Alright, so hi, uh, I'm here at my dad's house. La say hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Okay, so last weekend we watched Taxi Driver, and we, uh, we, li we, uh, we liked Taxi Driver, we were entertained by it, but this week we watched The King of Comedy, uh, the Robert De Niro movie. And to be honest with you, I didn't really like the message The King of Comedy was giving off. I thought, you know, the whole psychosis and wanting to be famous and... Uh, you know, some guy who's delusional about being a comedian uh, hit a little too close to home for me, and it, I didn't really, I didn't really like like the um, the message and and the story. I'm not saying it was a bad movie. I can see why some people might be entertained by it and why some people might actually like it. But me personally, um, I found it. Uh, dis uh, not, not disturbing. Disturbing isn't the right word because I could have easily sat through the movie. But I didn't. I didn't really appreciate it. And uh, you know, after after you know the sessions with Dr. Garrett and learning more about you know psychiatry, I, I just I just didn't find the message all that uh, you know intelligent and such. And I, I just didn't. I just didn't like the message it was spreading about psychosis and mental illness. And yeah, it wasn't inspiring to, to, to you. No, and I don't think I don't think it even really made like really valid points. I mean, I, I get that I, I get that the uh, De Niro or whatever the character's name was was living in a fantasy land, you know, daydreaming he's going to be a a movie star. And I, I mean, I, I got what was going on, and you know, obviously the host of the show uh, didn't, you know, did, you know, thought of him as just this loser, loser, this delusional guy. I mean, I, I got I got the concept, but I, I didn't think it really made. Uh, it, it, the points are very sensationalistic and not really that intelligent, in my opinion. And uh, and I, I just I just didn't appreciate it. I didn't think I didn't th I didn't think it really told a really intelligent story about mental illness, in my opinion. No, I, I agree. Th that, that, that's that's how that's that's how I saw it. So we actually turned the movie off after about forty minutes or so. And uh, yeah, I just I just didn't like the movie really. I didn't like the King of Comedy. Very fair. And, and it's not to say the movie isn't good. I mean, maybe there's people that like it, but I, I personally thought it hit a little too close to home for me. You made a good choice, Andrew. Cool.